So basically, I do whatever Nathan does, minus 10. <laughs> I might have a minus 10 range by the end of this. <laughs> There's nothing left. You got one, you got one more, you got one more. Good morning, party people. We've got a special guest here today. Hello, my name's Ethan. <laughs> Hello, how are you? <laughs> so Ethan and I, Ethan's also part of the Gymshark team. A uh, fairly new recruit. Fairly new recruit, like yeah. a month or two old. So, yeah. so we're going to run through a push, pull, pull, pull session today. Yeah. Don't listen to me, I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> we're going to run through a pull session this morning, doing a few mix up exercises maybe you haven't done before. Yep. Uh, Ethan's off on travels tomorrow, so we're going to make this a big session. That's not that big. <laughs> trying to look good for the holiday. <laughs> That's the way yeah. it is. That's what we're all training for, look good for holidays. <laughs> Should we get in them? Let's do it, man. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna warm up here with some body weight stuff. So we're gonna do some basic hanging scapular retractions. Super easy. I'll go this way so you can see. Up, hanging. Lovely. Glitch is getting everything moving and functioning through. So get through. Turn on. These grips are fat. They are fat. You get yeah, that fat grip on the way. <laughs> Head through as well, you like, pull up from here. So here? Yeah. Oh, back to tight, boy. <sighs> I want to point out here, we got a fellow member of Team Tuck right here. <sighs> I'm all about the team. Yeah, tuck. always. Always, oh, man. Hell yeah. Next thing we do is another body weight thing here. So we're going to go into neutral grip pull ups. It's a really great way of activating everything. It's also a big combat movement, so it's really hard to do at the end of a workout. So I like to start with these ones. Yeah. So. That's my name. <laughs> uh, he's had a huge transformation in the past 12 months. Tell the people um, what you've done. Last year, I was weighing in at 110 kilos. Now, 83, 84. Yeah. With a lot more muscle definition, I suppose. Yeah, um, yeah. Just woke up one day and realized that if I wanted to be in any good shape throughout like, my prime years, then it needs to happen now. Yeah. And I sort of just, Took the, took the switch and never looked back. I was like, I'm never gonna be like that again. Yeah, incredible. And just got addicted. Like, really, really, really addicted. A lot of people don't realize as well, like once you start, the hardest thing for most people is starting. Yeah. Once you've made that decision, you've committed to it, it gets easier and easier because it becomes a habit, which becomes a passion. It's a lifestyle change, that's yeah, what it is. Yeah, absolutely. Complete lifestyle's overhaul, so. Yeah, it's incredible, I love that. <laughs> Set number three, we're just gonna do three sets of this one, trying to be consistent. So for me, I'm going for 10 to 12 reps on each one. Two from failure, because we don't want to pre-exhaust ourselves too much. Gotta love that little crack noise that your body oh, makes. My Gotta love that little cracking <laughs> noise your body makes. As one time I was doing bench, I did like the, the arch in my back and my whole chest was fixed, and I was like, yes! <laughs> yeah, if I know I can't get like another few reps, I'll just go really solid. Thank you guys, caught that. So what he's doing there is working on eccentric work. So as you're saying, at the end, when you're at the point where you're like, you know what, I don't know if I can pull up another one, that last one goes slowly as controlled all the way down. It's when you really get that high trophy, so that extra muscle building element of it. Lovely. One is down, chest up, and we're trying to bring our elbow as far behind the body as we can. That's kind of the essential thing. I've talked about this in the channel before. When you're pulling back, you want to get your elbow behind the body. If you're pulling down, you want to bring your elbow down to your hips. Easy, nice and simple. Come 
I want to talk to you. Come on, come on. <laughs> so the next set here, so as we said, we're doing the row. The way I'm functioning at the moment is I like to go through a warm up set, whatever movement I'm doing, and then straight into the heavier sets. So rather than burning myself out by doing a lot of reps beforehand, get the movement in, get the movement patterns working, and then go into a heavier set. So I'm straight on here, I'm going to do these with 30s, see how it feels, but this should be my working set here. Again, 10 or 12 reps. Trying to keep up with this guy, so I've, <laughs> I've had to go up and wait too for the last set here. So uh, last set, I'm going to still go for try to go for eight reps here. Um, it's a big step up in weight, so we'll see how we go. Got it, boy. Enthusiasm, my name. Boy, good. Solid. Got it easy. It was not much. <laughs> <laughs> if you're like me and you're old and falling apart, I use straps here, so keep them branded. Your yeah, guts to be branded. You love it. I um, love to see it. But this way, it just takes the pressure out of the grip. Forearms aren't going to be activated as much. I can really pull through the elbows rather than engaging through there. Now, this is double handed. Yeah. Next move we're going to do is isolateral. Okay. So, I try and do a lot of time a double and a single. Yeah. So, I'm hitting imbalances. Yeah. So, the next one, I'm pretty sure you won't have done before. Yeah. It's okay. a fun one. Ready. This next exercise is one of my own design. I may not have made it up, but no one taught me it, therefore, it's mine. <laughs> okay. So, what we're doing here is it's a variation of a seated row. We're doing this single arm kneeling, like so. Back, keep it on the side of the bench here. And when we're pulling, twist that body slightly. Solid. So see there, we want to get that back. Yeah, pull it on neutral. Yeah. yeah. Oosh, the Nathan bro. <laughs> the Nathan bro. <laughs> Center to really yeah. pull with your back. Oh, yeah, feel this. Moving on to the next pull movement, which is going to be rear delt focused. Ready? We're going to do a superset. This is going to be face pulls, 
with skiers. So I'll demonstrate both moves first. Yep. Face pulls, sitting down, holding hands at the top, and you twist him in. Yep. And then you're pulling the middle of the rope up to your forehead. Yep. Nice. Still going through some that. Straight into skiers. Here. Skiers are like a ski. Yep. In. Ah, okay, nice. But trying to keep your arms beside your body so you're not flaring out yeah, so much. Right. Cool. Okay, nice. After you. I'll do it first. Good. Yeah. Very nice. Get that full gap traction. Perfect. Get that full gap for me, buddy. I'll be a fan. There you go. Yeah. Follow the one away. Good, man. I'm just getting your bit skill. That's it, yeah, yeah. Cutting shapes. Ethan's instantly getting this, which is so good. His elbows are staying up in line with his shoulders, so he's pulling nice and high. Not pulling down and using his lats. He's really using the rear delts, pulling up nice and high. <laughs> Woo! Hell yeah. Get to 10 and it's just high. <laughs> Woo! I'm barely yeah. moving! Yeah. Stiff. Cook it now! Cook it! Cook it! <laughs> that's, the, that's the piece of... But take you to I did it, but uh, yeah. I wish it did. I'm gonna educate you. Come on in children, <laughs> let's learn. So, Ethan, what were you saying you wanna want to focus on so, right now? My, my biceps are there. I've got a quite a decent sized tricep, not much of a peak on the biceps. So, I've been trying to incorporate some peak training yeah. just to make them pop out a bit more. How's so. that little pop? So the peak being yeah. that little bit there. So the way we're gonna focus on that is we're gonna do these bicep curl, but they're called drags. So, in neutral position, same as normal. Probably a little bit more narrow, potentially. In, and when we're curling, we're dragging the bar up the body. So you can see my hands are staying in nice and close. And you can nice. see the peak contracting at the top there. Feeling it. Good. You can tell I've just never really trained peaks like yeah. Yeah. properly. Oh! You can see that my right nipples come here to play. That's <laughs> you know you work on that. That's when you hit the biceps. I need to keep the bar close to my body. Yep. There you go. Good. Keep that scap contracted too. It's gonna have to pull up. There you go. Yeah, that, that one feels a bit. Good. Oh yeah. You can see it contracting up too. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. That, that's a kind of lot better. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. Hello! So we're moving on now onto alternating dumbbell curls. So these ones, we're gonna go up, twist, down, other arm. With these ones, you don't wanna move the next arm until this one's back stationary again. Otherwise, it's gonna be using momentum to swing. It yeah. kinda of looks like you're dancing. So, which we're saving from it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> dance along. <laughs> Basically, 
I do whatever Nathan does, minus 10. <laughs> <laughs> I'll grab 10s, yeah, just to focus on that. So, what Ethan's saying there is not just a funny thing. Yeah. It's actually such an important thing. Yes. You do you. Yep. The worst thing you do is try and compare yourself to whoever you're training with because everyone has their own body types, everyone has their own path. Even though you're making a joke there, yeah, it is so true. true. Yeah. Because the best thing you do is do what's right for you. You're gonna make the most growth by doing the weight. I'm just making you stand there holding yeah. the <laughs> Making yourself do what works for you rather than what works for someone else. It's the only way you're gonna succeed. So, well done to you, son. <laughs> Very nice. You heard it. Oh yeah. Go on. Keep breathing, keep breathing. Those partials. Once you get to that point, yeah. I want you to do some little partials. Yeah. Yep. 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 Good. Oh, nice. Woo! Hey, so we've got one more set here of the alternating curls, but because I'm a terrible human, I'm gonna make this a drop set this last one. So we're gonna go through <laughs> and rack it. Okay, so, uh, you're gonna go 10, 8, yeah. 6, 4. Yeah. I'm gonna go. Yeah, yeah. AMRAP. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. I'm gonna go. I might drop by two at a time. Yeah. Otherwise, I'll be dead. So yeah. I'm gonna go. 20, 16, 12, 8, 4. Cool. Yeah. Let's get it. What, what, what's the thing you say before you start? Oh, easy money. 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 Easy Try it, fuck it. Great, hell yeah. Might as well. If you get three good reps, yeah. it's still three good reps. Hell yeah. yeah. Good, man. Finish with the super set the cables. Ah! <laughs> Thank you. I'm hey, ready. We're making a big I'm one. ready. Here we go. I might have a bicep for you by the end of this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Super set time to finish. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna hit. A, yeah, it's ah! it's gonna be a supinated kneeling curl or a preacher curl variation. Supinated, supinated, holding a ball of soup, and then we're gonna do a neutral grip hammer curl on the ropes. So, single arm on these, double on there, no break, getting it done. Ready? I'm gonna lead. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. <laughs> Essentially, I have it there so it just sits comfortably on the tricep. Yeah. So it's just nice pressure on the knee. So you can see here, this is a really great variation on a preacher girl. If you're in a gym that doesn't have a preacher machine, 
you can use this as a variation. So use your own arm to lean against, creates that angle like a single arm creature. Try DIY, it. DIY, do it yourself. Yeah. You don't need to preach a bench. Good. Ah, we finished with that, but um, it's a big session. We said it's gonna be a big session, so we're gonna finish with some pull-ups here. So we're just gonna do this on the rack. I'm gonna do these supinated, more bicep focused with a little bit of lats in there. Let's see if we can burn out. Yeah, I'm down, I'll join you. Right. See, what I, see what I've got left in the tank. Wait, what, are you, what are you gonna get? What are you gonna call me? Call uh, before you start here. I wanna see what you can I'll try, uh, uh, five to six, I reckon. Five I, reckon six. I, I would get five to six, but maybe like two sets of five to six, I reckon. Let's Try do that. one set. All right, one set just to. But as soon as you drop, you get back up. You're okay. Drop and get back yeah. up. Okay. So one set. Right. As many reps as possible. Right. Let's do it. Amra, let's do it. <laughs> Crazy, man. I want to hurt. Yeah. I want to feel me like, oh, yeah. I regret that. Wake up in the morning, roll over. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, there's my body. Yeah, there it is. Right. Easy. Easy. Three more stuff, yeah? Three more in the tank. Three more in the tank. Five, two, three, two. Light work. Let's go. Grind it. Everything. Everything left. Oh, tank empty. Tank empty. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice, nice. Good stuff. Good. Two, three, four, one more at least. Two on, you go, you go, you go. Ah! Okay, drop, Jake. Five, four, three, two, one. At least two more. Ah! <laughs> There's nothing left. You got one there, you got one more, you got one more. Shake him out, shake him out. Five, four, three, two, one. Up. Okay, lift. Up. Thank right you. Slow again, slow again. And one more, one more. Up. Ah. Slow again. Oh, I'm exhausted. <laughs> oh, I'm exa I was literally trying to fight it. It was just like, nope, bye. We're down. Yeah. Bye, we're going back to the ground. Where I belong. Finished. Nice to man. Thank you. Thank you very much. That's fun. Lovely workout. If you guys have any questions, ask them. Always happy to help. Ethan, from the man. Thank you. Absolute pleasure. Thank you for having me. Links down below. You're probably already following him. He's a much, much more influential person than most people I know. Yeah. So, uh, if not, make sure you follow him. Congratulations to your journey. Thank you very much, it. man. Appreciate it. Stay track, because uh, I expect big things here. See you guys soon.